Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. In this video session, I'm going to provide you the answer of multiple choice question of chapter number seven, that is digital literacy. Question number one is, dash is a key requirement for conducting a qualitative interview. In me se kaun si requirement hai jo ke qualitative interview conduct karne ke liye use ki jati hai. Number A is planning and implementation. Survey, talking with interview, data analysis. Justification is correct. Answer is A. Means planning and implementation. B. Survey. Survey. The purpose of survey is used for quantitative research, not qualitative interview. Talking with interviews necessary, but without planning, it lacks structure. And D is the data analysis. Mean comes after the interview not a requirement to conduct it these are my justification for the correction of option a question number two which software can be used to create eye-catching infographics ms word ms powerpoint ms excel ms access okay the correct option is ms powerpoint that is option b MS Word used for text processing, not ideal for visuals. As I told you, B is the correct option is Microsoft PowerPoint. MS Excel mainly used for calculation purpose. Access is the database management. Question number three. Dash is the process of representing a model in terms of time and space. Communication, simulation, control system, or radar. The correct option is B, that is simulation. Why not others? Communication refers to exchange of information, not modeling. Control system, manage system behavior, but not about representation. Radar, detects objects, not a modeling tool. Question number four, dash refers to a basic version of a product used for testing. What survey, questionnaire, prototype, and chart? The correct option is the prototype, that is C option. Why not others? Because survey used for collecting data, not product testing. Questionnaire contains structured questions, not a product model. Chart, visual representation of data unrelated to product creation. Question number five, the process of creating synthetic or fake data that resembles real world data is referred to as dash presentation, simulation, primary data, secondary data. The justification correct answer is the simulation. Why not others? Because presentation display information does, that does not generate data. B, that is the correct option. C, primary data, originally data collected directly from a source that will become a primary data. Secondary data, already existing data reused from other studies. That is called secondary data. Question number six, dash are graphics and images describing information visually. Option A is Visual text, option B is worksheets, option C is infographics, option D is secondary data. The correct option is infographics. Why not others? Visual text, not a technical terms, loosely refer to any visible content. Worksheets used for data entry and analysis, not visual storytelling. D is secondary data. A type of data, not a visual tool. The correct option is infographics. Question number seven dash is the process of using graphical formats to visually represent relationship between data sets, that is primary data, secondary data, and presentation survey. The correct option is presentation. Why not others? Primary data, raw data, 
that is unprocessed information is called the data. Secondary data, pre-existing data not focused on visual representation. D option survey, method to collect information not presenting it. Short response question and answer. Define digital literacy and its significance. Digital literacy is the ability to find, evaluate, create, and communicate information using digital technologies. It enables individuals to participate fully in the digital world, digital world, including education, communication, and professional life. Question number two is differentiate between simulation and prototype. Simulation are computer generated methods, computer generated method that imitate real world process for analysis and understanding purpose. Prototypes are early working models or products that allow users to test design and functionality before full scale of production. Question number three, write steps to design a Google Forms to conduct a survey. First, sign into your Google account. Okay, open Google Forms. Yes, okay. Then add a title. Tab aapne title add karna hai, phir uske description add karni hai. Create various question types like a multiple choice question, short answer, adjust required setting. Sometimes some important question you must require. Set the option required settings and finally share form link to collect your responses. Question number four, write a short note on data simulation. Data simulation refers to the process of creating synthetic data sets that resembles a real world. real world It is useful for testing models and system when real data is limited or inaccessible, ensuring the system performs correctly under various conditions. Question number five, how are reports a good tool for data presentation? Reports are effective for summarizing and communicating data in an organized manner. They often include charts, graphs, and written explanations which make complex information more understandable and help in decision making process. Thanks dear students and if you like my video, please subscribe my channel and share it with your friends and be connected with me. And if you have any question, you can ask me in comment. Thank you. Jazakallah khair.